Last time on Turtle Pokemon Resort, our contestants finally solved the mystery of Aquarius Resort! Indeed. In the end, Luxray's father was revealed to be the one behind it all, and he was finally taken into custody. Eleven are left. Who will we eliminate next? Find out today. Congratulations, Samurat. You have finally completed your training. I am very proud of you. Thanks, Superior. No problem. Now it's time to properly put it to use. I'm sure you've had thoughts of this, but now it's time to act. I want you to blindside me. Very well. It, wow, you're, you're not surprised at anything. You've been thinking about this for a while, haven't you? Excellent. That's the kind of strategist I'd love to see. Someone who thinks several moves ahead and can act without any command. What's to say I haven't already planned it out? <laughs> well, regardless of if whether or not you plan something against me by now, I would not make it easy for you to blindside me. I want the challenge. And you'll get just that. <laughs> Excellent. Excellent! Samaroth has completed her training and is now ready to be her own strategist. I'm proud of her. But like I said, I will not make it easy for her. She's going to have to work for that blind side. But still, thinking several moves ahead. Impressive, Samaroth. Especially for someone like you. Oh, don't worry, Superior. You will get your blind side. Because, Superior, your use in this game has concluded. Man, this week I've been fun, hasn't it? Yep, all that off-screen fun that no one will get to see. Hey, you see them too? What? Never mind. So, now that the game is back on, what's the plan for Merge? Oh, I have plans for the Merge. But we don't know if it'll happen today or in several weeks. But we just had a big event, and as everyone knows, merges always happen after big events, like New Year's, or the Zelda event. Oh, come on, Sammy, you know you love my style of humor. Yes, and I hate that sometimes. Anyways, for now, let's focus on the plan if we don't merge today. Gardevoir is the bigger threat of the two. She's friends with Ninetales and Luxray and could easily sway some of the males to her side if the merge comes. But what if she has an idol? It could have been in those places where we did the investigation. Way ahead of you. Illumis and Butterfree will put votes in nine tails just in case an idol is played. Excellent! And they know this already? I told them a few minutes ago. Damn, you're good. So in that case, how about we go to the gym and spar? I've got some new moves since evolving. <laughs> you're on. Alright, now that the whole Aquarius incident is done, we can get back to the game. Indeed. So what should we do about the merge? Here's the thing. I think it's best we stick with Samurott's alliance. Let her take the heat from the other players, and then we can blindside her. If we try to make a move now, we won't last long, especially against the boys' alliance. So right now, let's follow her plan. 
And mana when it's the game, but hey, it would help us get closer to Jirachi's wish and surprise both their parents. Fair enough. Now then, we got a few hours before the challenge. Let's go try out the hot springs that were recently installed. Hell yeah, let's do it. Well, here we are again. Yep, now without our leader. Yeah. But hey, we still have a chance to bounce back. The merge could change everything. Plus, there's still an odd to be found. Very true. But what do we do if we lose again and the merch isn't here? Simple. We vote our pots are free. She's too much of a wild card and could easily screw us over. Especially since she's with the enemies all the time. Plus, she did screw us over with the whole Meganium vote. Exactly. However, I do have an idea for merch. I propose an alliance with us, Luxray, and Delphox. Why is that? that? With Luxray, he's with no one as of now, so might as well skip him up quick. As for Del Fox, I know I can trust him. Plus, you two seem to get along well. I agree with Del Fox, but why Luxray? Something seems off with that. No, he makes sense. If we don't grab him, someone else will. He's aligned with no one at the moment. Oh, right. Okay, I like the idea. But let's just, ho just hope we survive long enough to reach Merge, okay? We will. Just think positively. That's what I've been doing this past week or so. So, is that a this meaning? Pretty much. Besides, I gotta go talk with Lux Luxray anyway. Okay, have fun with that. I'm gonna go with Del Fox and check out the hot springs. Okay, have fun! I should be concerned about this four-person alliance, but I know Gardevoir isn't stupid. She clearly picked those two for a reason, and her reasons do make sense. If they can help us bounce back, fantastic, since that is exactly what we need right now. But if not, then we're screwed. I really don't want to think negatively right now, especially after that whole Vulpix shit. But this is still a game, and as it stands, we have no control. The reason I chose Delphox and Luxray for our lives is because I know I can trust them. Delphox is my brother, and we have a pretty good sibling bond. Probably better than most siblings. With Luxray, he's not with anyone at the moment, and the two of us have formed a pretty good friendship over the last little while. Because of that... I know these true and betray us when the merch hits. The bond is too strong for that to happen. Is that true? Shut up. But like Ninetales said, we need to make it to the merch first before we can even form that alliance. Just an idea at the moment. So, Luxray, I just heard Ninetales about the alliance offer. Okay, and what did you say? She was okay with the idea, but wanted to focus on making it to the merge first. Makes sense, especially since we don't know when the merge will happen. Agreed, but I do have to ask Luxray, why did you accept my offer? Well, we're friends. We get along pretty well, and you're probably the only person who's asked me to be in an alliance, so that's why. Ah, okay. Well, I really do appreciate you being in the alliance. Thanks. I'm glad that I get to be in an alliance with someone that cares. Luxray, of course I care about you. Same with Ninetales. That's great. It shows that you have a caring heart. That's a useful skill for helping people. Indeed, especially for my loved ones. And your boyfriend. I'm sure he loves that about you. Yes. He does love that about me. That's great to hear. Okay, I gotta go and return this book, so I'll see you later. Okay, take care. Wow, this is the hot springs. Wow, it looks really nice. Hell yeah! Who would have guessed that this resort would pretty much be back in about a week? In order, in about a week, you mean? Yeah. Damn it. Well, to be fair, Dark Ray is pretty good with magic. Indeed. By the way, Ninetales, I wanted to thank you for the help last week when I was recovering. That was really nice of you to do that. No problem. Besides, I did cause that injury. It's only fair that I repay you for it. Well, either way, that was really nice of you to do that. Hell, show me that I can trust you in this guy. Thank you. So you heard about Gardevoir's plan then? Yep, looking forward to it. Certainly would be a nice change of pace in comparison to my alliance, which is a war zone right now. What do you mean? Well, Ivani is a pretty cool dude. Superior is too much of a threat to keep around, and Lucario snaps whenever he's under pressure. Not exactly a good environment for your alliance. 
Eh, sounds like Superior's alliance back in music. So this alliance could be a change of pace. Fair enough. Anyways, wanna hop in? <laughs> no, I just wanna stare at it. Of course I wanna go in. Bitchin'. Oh, Ron, I have something for you. Just a while saying thanks for the help. Diamonds, bitches! Wait, why is everything different now? We got a color palette! Whatever. Greetings, contestants! Hope you enjoyed your week off. Now it's game time once again! As such, it's time for you all to compete in your next challenge. But this time, it's an individual challenge! You guys will be placed on large poles in the ocean while also keeping a tiki over your head. If you fall off the pole or the tiki falls over, you're out. Last male and female standing win immunity. But the last player standing gets a special treat. So, let's begin! So, looks like the merge is here after all. Excellent. <laughs> you guys have been going at it for about a half an hour now. Good job. But now it's time to spice it up. See, having guys up on that power would be boring. So we're going to give you incentives to jump off. So to kick things off, the first person who jumps off will get a clue to a special item in this game. Well then. I don't like that. Butterfree is out. But here's your clue. Ach okay. So, how does it feel, Lily Mace, to have your own friend abandon you like that for a clue? I know what you're trying to do, Gardevoir. It's not working. Just keep trying to keep those things of yours balanced. Shit! Wait, where'd that uh, Demanitan go? Just, just shut up and keep balancing. Shit. Okay, you guys have been going at it for an hour now. Time to spice it up again. <laughs> God, that voice crack. One of the advancements this result recently got was the royal suite. It's absolutely beautiful and you get treated like royalty in there. Including free food, drinks and relaxation machines. Why is that a thing? I don't fucking know. If you jump off within the first 10 seconds, you'll get it for the entire season until you're out of the game. But if no one accepts it, I will change the weather around you to make this much harder. In this case, I will make the winds much more powerful. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh. The fuck, bro? The fuck, man? Okay, Del Fox gets the royal suite, but he lost a chance at individual immunity. Why'd I do that, you may ask? Well, even though I can handle the harsh conditions, I know I'll be safe tonight. And if not, eh yeah, well, still got the royal suite for at least a few hours. Shit. Shit. Shit! Why does that Dermanitan- Why is it that sometimes the Dermanitan stays in their head? The better question is, why doesn't it shake when some of us are, like, shaking? Yeah, uh, good point. Shit, 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 shit! Shit! With that, six remain! Now it's time to make things interesting once again! How the fuck did Ninetales fall off anyways? I have no idea, that's a good question. Shit, 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 oh man, yep, the poles are now even smaller now, which means it'll be even harder to keep your balance on there, oh, and the temptations are gonna keep coming, 
Good luck! Shit, shit! Shit! Oh, man! Shit, shit! <laughs> shit! <laughs> shit! Shit! Alright, time to bring in the next temptation! This time, TRUTH ON air. Excellent. My truth is too clefable. If you had to choose between any of the guys, or girls if you prefer, to go on a date with, who would be your choice and why? I ask this because you've hardly talked to anyone outside of Samurott, so it would help that the others get to know you a bit better. Yeah, sure thanks Sebastian. In all honesty, I'm the kind of person who loves adventure. The kind of girl who go to China and wrestle with 20 pandas. The kind of girl who climb up the tallest mountain and go snowboarding off it. The kind of girl who loves to travel back in time to fight Nazis and punch Hitler in the face. That would be a good one. As such, the person I prefer in a partner is either someone with similar interests or meets my physical standards. So in terms of this game, I guess I pick someone like Lee Vanny for the guys or someone like Samara for the girls. If I was into that, of course. Hey, hey, Kali. Huh. Okay, that was not really surprising now that I think about it. I mean, this is Clefable who I'm talking about. Hell, during that break, she told me that she would love to visit a dimension to fight a kaiju-sized superior in Gothitelle just because she saw it in a movie or something. Who the fuck made that? I don't know where she gets these ideas from, but that's just who she is, I guess. Hey, Clefable, how are you able to still hold that thing on your head? That thing is heavy. How are you still able to hold it? Well, I have a giant fucking shell on my head. I think it'll be long song before coming to the challenge. Something about the strength of a raging fire. Wait, so you watched Mulan? Hell yeah, one of my favorite Disney movies. Oh my god, I love that movie too! You do? Hell yeah! Oh, that's kick ass! Right, I'm out. Wait, did Samara just leave because she was tired of that conversation? I guess you could say it's the Pokemon def er, personification of fuck this shit, I'm out. Well then, I remain. Time to shorten it again. No, 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 fuck! Shit! Shit! Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck me! Four to go! Time for the next temptation! Hello! Okay, time to give Luxray a challenge. Luxray, take your shirt off. I ch um... No, I'm not even a human, Del Fox. How the hell would that work? Oh, I can do it! God damn it! Alright, fine, just, just do it already. Okay, now take it off. Oh, fine. Psych! Oh well, well shit. Damn, you can grind hyenas on those abs. Why am I not surprised? Hey, Gardevoir, what do you got to say about this, Gardevoir? Well, um, that was embarrassing. <laughs> Shut up. Shit, shit, shit. Fuck. Wait, why did it take so long for that to sink? Crap! Shit, shit! Ah, fuck this. Time to go fight Jaws! Whee! <laughs> did I take some drugs or something? Anyways, congrats, Lex Rain Gadawa! You are safe! But now it's time to find out who will get the special reward! So, time to shrink it. Shit, 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 Damn it, Lex Rain, fall already! Shit, shit, shit! Hell no! I've had a long to far worse than this! Shit, shit! Fine then! <laughs> I'll just use my Mega Stone! <laughs> oh, you mean this? Shit! Fuck. Uh, 
Thank you. Congratulations, Luxray, on winning the bonus! And congratulations, Gather One Luxray, for winning individual immunity! Now, as for the bonus, I will have you read that later, Luxray, at elimination. <laughs> oh, and, um, one more thing! When did I say that we're merged? What? Th so, so that means... Yep, Team Levion is going to elimination tonight, bitches! But after that, the teams will be merged. Now, since Team Tortaro won, they'll get the chance to watch Team Leafeon's elimination ceremony. See you then! Well, shit! Looks like we're not merging after all. Th 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 that means... So, so, Nine Tails might be going home tonight. Shit! So, we still executing the plan? I just told Lily Mies and Butterfree to vote out Ninetales, so yeah. As for us, I have a different plan. Now that we know when the merge is coming, it's time to make a big move, and I don't know just how to do it. And eliminating Ninetales isn't a big move? Listen, Gardevoir could easily give Ninetales an idol, so we're still splitting the votes. It's just our votes will be on one of our quote-unquote associates, because Butterfree is a wild card and Lily Mies and her are tight together. Meaning they can easily switch over to another alliance, and then we're screwed. If it doesn't work, we still have a tie. Then we can make the final decision in the free vote. But if it does work, after tonight, we'll have control over the game. Excellent. Alright guys, let's talk. With the merge coming up, we need to stick together. No infighting, no petty shit, unity. Otherwise, we're going to get picked off one by one. But if that bonus is something like, we have to vote someone off, I think it's best we all place a vote in each other in alphabetical order. So like, I vote for Livani and then Livani, Lucario, and that kind of shit. <clears throat> and then let Luxray decide who's worthy of being safe. Because guys, we're gonna fall apart unless we work together. We're gonna end the path of superiors and launch back and music if we don't do this. Well, shit. When it's that bad, it must be important enough to fix. Okay, I mean... Besides, I'm probably the only one who can deal with Samarat, given her intellect now. I'm in. I can't do much socially, but I am physically strong. Of course, I'm in. I'm pretty much the glue at this point. Alright, let's do it. Besides, if anything, it'll probably just be a clear to the idol or something, or maybe an advantage. Welcome, Team Le'Veon, to your third elimination! And technically your last. Shit. Now, as I mentioned before, Team Tortella is going to be watching this. Sorry. So they get to see it firsthand who goes home. Now then, if anyone has an idol, now would be the time to play it. What? Where, where did you get that? Do you recall when Delphox and I invested that prison room? Delphox found it in there, then he gave it to me as a present for helping him when his eye messed up. It's possible that this may be fake, but at this point I am willing to roll the dice and see what happens. Very well! This. Is. Not. A fake hidden immunity idol. All the votes cast for Nine Tails will not count. Thank you, Del Fox. I'll read the votes. First vote! Nine Tails does not count. Nine Tails does not count. We have no votes for anybody. Butterfree! I don't know why I was hanging there for some reason, but there you go. Butterfree! Two votes, Butterfree. No votes for anybody, which means Butterfree, if you get this next vote tonight, or it's for the Ninetales, you may go home. Actually, if you get a vote after this, you will go home. What the fuck am I saying? Two votes left. First vote. Illumise. What? Two votes, Butterfree. One vote, Illumise. One vote left. Final vote. 
Hello, Mies. Oh, come the fuck on, really? And with that, we're tied. So here's how we go. Butterfree and Illumise, you will not vote. Everyone else, you can only vote for Butterfree or Illumise. So, now that we got that done, here we go. And because of that, there's only four votes left, so there you go. First vote! Butterfree! Illumise, one vote each. Illumis! Two votes Illumis! One vote Butterfree! One vote left. Final vote! Butterfree! We are tied once again. So, here's what we'll do. Those who can vote, come up with a final decision. No, if I want, if I end up going home tonight, it will not be decided by these clowns. Illumines, what are you getting at? Butterfree, if one of us is going to go down, I think we should let the ones who watch over us decide. Lady Luck herself, in this case. Are you saying, let's draw rocks? Illumines, in order for that to work, the others would have to be up for it. Wait, what the fuck? I thought it would just be the two of us. We had to change the rules because a few people weren't too happy about it. Which means Samurott and Clefable would also be eligible since they are not immune. And because Nine does play the rattle, she is immune, so there you go. I'm in. I'm in. Samurott? Let's roll the dice and see which one of us deserves to stay in this game. Very well. God of War Nine Tails, you are safe. Everyone else, let's draw rocks. Here's how it will go. Each rock morphs into a special cat. Once I snap my fingers, the rocks will transform into cats. Since there are four of you, there are four different colours. White is safety. Gold means you'll get an advantage in the next challenge. Green means great luck for those with intelligence. And black is death. So whoever gets black will get eliminated. So here we go. One of you will be going home. In a few seconds. Let's count it down. Five, four, three, two, one. <sighs> no, no, Mies. It's fine, Butterfree. Just do your best, okay? Sorry I had to come down to this, Illumise, but your bond with Butterfree made you a big wild card who could easily betray us. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I played my hand, and I lost. To be honest, Samurai, I was likely going to betray you anyways, because you're as big a threat as you are tall now. Hey, what about me? Clefable, you're not a fucking threat! Okay? Not everything's about... You know what, I'm not even going to finish that. But you know what? I had fun. I made some good friends, and despite getting 11th place, I didn't go down the same path as my dad. God of War and Nine Tails, it was fun playing against you. Clefable, despite our short time knowing each other, you're certainly interesting. Samurott, despite my earlier comment, I do admit your move was a good one. Now I hope that mine and yours doesn't go to waste. As for Butterfree, despite our differences in the beginning, I quickly eroded as we got to know each other more and more, and I'll never forget that. As for that goal we set, don't worry about it, okay? Just do your best, and if it gets you to the finals, great. If not, be proud that you did what you could on your own. Your mother pretty much gave up after her girlfriend left, or in this case, Butterfree. If you can keep going, then you'll surpass her in this game. I know it. That's all I gotta say, so I'll see you guys later. Oh, you'll be seeing them soon, Illumise, because you're the first member of our jury! <laughs> oh, really? Sweet! Alright, good luck, girls. I'll be rooting for you. So, what the fuck do we do with these cats, then? Hmm? Oh, well, I guess you... I guess we don't exactly need them now, do we? Is there chocolate in it? Oh, my Jesus. Well, it was certainly fun. 
got to meet some great people, and hey, got to meet Butterfree. I'll let you guys figure out where what I mean by that in whatever the hell and whoever the hell's watching this. The hell am I saying? Whatever, let's just go. Later. Well, okay then. Here's the votes. And the re-votes, huh? Go figure. Now then, Luxray, please read the note. Very well, the fuck. You have just seen the elimination of someone from one tribe. Now it is your turn. Shit. Indeed. Now, obviously Luxray's still safe, but it's time for you guys to vote! Shh. Tell folks what were you thinking? You want unity, yet you hid something big from all of us! What the hell were you thinking? Tell folks you had an idol and you never told us! Why? Even your bro? I thought we were supposed to be united! That may have screwed me over, but at least I could say I did something in this game. Going into this very time, I'm uncertain of who to vote for. It's very difficult for me to decide. Now then, it's time to vote! Actually, hear that, Doc Rai. I want to say something. Oh, well, okay. Interrupt me during my fucking speech. I know you guys are likely mad at me for not telling you about that idol and giving it to our enemy. I'm not gonna lie, I would happily do it again fair. But here's the thing, if I wanted to betray you guys, I would have kept the idol for myself. I sacrificed my safety with that idol, not only to repay a friend for helping me, but so that I would be on the same playing field as my alliance. We formed this alliance back on day one because we shared similar interests in our good chemistry. I meant what I said earlier, if we don't stay unified, we'll be crossed by samurai on no alliance. In fact, it sucks that I have to vote for one of you tonight. It really fucking does. Look, if you three want to vote me out for that move, fine. I'll leave with my head held high. If not, then you know what to do. That's all I gotta say. That's all I got. Very well. Let's vote. What the fuck are you thinking, bro? Now then, if anyone has an idol... Now would be the time to do so. I really doubt someone has an idol by this point. Del Vox just gave up his. Very well. I'll read the votes. First to vote. Superior. Del Fox. Lucario. What? Levani. One vote Lucario. One vote Levani. One vote Del Fox. One vote Superior. One vote left. Final vote. Superior. Since the votes seem to have gone in the unified order, Luxray, why did you vote me out? Delphox told me what you said earlier. While I can't see as you possibly being the only one who can defeat Samurott, you are also smart enough to defeat all four of us. You screwed yourself over the minute you said that! Very well. At least I didn't get blindsided by my student. How cliche would, could that have been? But I do have to thank you. You guys at the boss realized how much of a threat I was and took me up before I started on my plans. To that, I tip my hat to you. Well, metaphorically, of course. I don't have hands. Good luck, you guys. May you stay unified despite the dark times ahead. Did I tell him he was on the jury? I don't think he did. Oh, well, he is on the jury. Well, uh, that was... Hmm. Actually, you know what? I really don't have a comment. I pretty much said what I needed to see. 
Semenoth, why are you here? Superior, you helped me when I was at my lowest point. You taught me all these things. You made me a stronger person. I came here so that I could thank you for all that. I'm glad to hear that I could help you. Now, we all get to see how effective you'll be as a strategist. I'll do my best, Superior. Then after this game is over, let's get a coffee or something. <laughs> I'd like that. See you around. Alright. Well, I guess you could say I got farther than my sister did. At least I made the fucking marriage. Ah oh, well. Later, guys. If I wasn't like his sister, he's on the jury. Aha! And here's the vet. Oh, they actually did the thing. Okay. <laughs> Hello, God of War. Uh, hello, Luxray. Why did you invite me here? It's about earlier. Yeah, I knew you were lying about the whole boyfriend thing. Okay, yes. I haven't had a boyfriend since I was 16 and that ended badly. Listen, I don't care. I'm not mad that you lied to me. I just wanted you to admit it, which you did. I hate to sound like that asshole, though, but... Please don't lie to me again, okay? I hate deceit. Okay, I promise. How'd you figure it out, though? Well, one, the nosebleed. Two, I noticed a hesitation when you were talking to me earlier about that. Fair enough. So, why'd you invite me here instead of somewhere else? Simple. So that the two of us could spend time together. Just the two of us. Heck, I'd be sitting in a room talking. True. So we go? <laughs> yeah, well, cool. Oh, come on, let's hop in. Well then. And with that, Eloise and Sapiria became the first and second members of the jury! Now that we've had two big moves, how will the newly merged team handle these developments? Will any new alliances form? Will old ones shatter? Find out next time on Turtle Pokemon Resort!